Twist it. Pass it. Pass it. Stop it. No. What up, you car batteries and power converters? <laughs> Okay, I've got to stop doing that. Some of those are miserable. Anyway, it's Kane Kaiser. Um, so this is a little bit of a special video. Well, not that special. You're going to watch me eat supper while I make this video. <laughs> got to get the ketchup on. There we go. By the way, I'm having chicken patties, fully cooked chicken patties that I just put in the microwave. Um, so I just wanted to make this video, putting that up, I want to make this video because I'm going to be working on a project again this summer. So back in 2020, yeah, 2020, I had made, um, Y2K, the channel that I used for nostalgia which turned out to be a huge flop 2021 I you or I did cane pop which is like my uh, k-pop review channel which that was a bigger flop but oh yeah and then 2022 I don't remember if it was 21 or 22 I made the bop at wiener dog well, this time I'm going to do something else with a bop it this summer. Um, and I guess I can tell you guys, um, I have talked with some people down near, near where my parents live. And I'm probably going to get an apartment down close to my parents. And I can tell you this. It'll be in a town called Dickinson. So Dickinson is west of Bismarck by like two hours you just go west on I-94 and Interstate 94 that is um but I'm gonna hopefully meet with the Independent Living Center and like figure out what am I gonna do for an apartment and stuff So, that'll be sometime in June, because after I graduate, I'm going to hope, if I graduate, that is, because my grades are kind of not doing so hot right now, I'm going to be going on vacation to Minnesota um, after a uh, instead of a graduation party. So, um, I'm going to be going to Minnesota and it's it's to a place called Park Rapids, Minnesota. And that is where I went to preschool in my younger years before I moved to North Dakota in 2006. So I'm going to see if I can get a hold of one of my old teachers and stuff like that. I'm going to go down to Mall of America cuz the last time I was at Mall of America was 2015. Um my best friend Abby, who I took to prom, she, uh, in 2020, she lives down there, so we're going to go to Mall of America together, so, it's going to be fun, um, but yeah, after, and that's going to be the weekend, but that's going to be the full week before Memorial Day weekend and Memorial Day weekend that's a, that's miserable I mean you guys in the UK and stuff like that I know you guys don't celebrate Memorial Day it's a US national holiday but I'll t I tell you what it gets crazy busy because people are going on vacation, they're going out to the lake, they're doing whatever. It's it's very busy. A very busy time. Especially, well, Labor Day and Memorial Day are like super busy days. So, anyway, 
back to the project. So I'm going to be with my parents quite a bit after I graduate from college, which will be May 12th, by the way. Um, that's a Friday. And I'm going to be going on vacation starting uh, the Saturday after the Saturday I graduate. So May 20th is when we'll be heading down to Minnesota. And, but until I get an apartment and stuff, and once we get stuff figured out, I do have a project that I'm going to work on. I'm going to see if my dad can help me with another Bop It project. So, I'm going to have to grab something quick. So one thing is that in a video from, I was gonna, I'm going to say two years ago on TikTok, I mentioned that bop -its, like the bop -it Shout and bop -it R2-D2 have a connection with someone in my life, and that is my dog Alex. You guys remember the video from 2020 when... He passed and I had to, uh, I made like a photo montage, like a 15 minute video slideshow to like, um, remember him. So, um, I sent a message to Dan Klitzner and I asked him, I said, is there a way, because I know he's made custom boppets and stuff like that for like Brent TV and Mothica, which I don't think you guys have heard of. She's uh, like a goth singer kind of thing. She's on TikTok. Um, anyway, I asked Dan if he could make, if he could like customize a boppet shout to have the color scheme or a color theme of my dog Alex, his colors. And his picture is right up there. I'm, I'm on my Windows PC and his picture is right right above me here. But I, I'm not gonna take it down because it's hard to it's hard it'll be hard to put back up. But something actually you know what I can just do it on my phone. I've got plenty I've got plenty of pictures of Alex in my phone. Yeah. So something with the Boppet Shout like my dog Alex. So, I mean, the Boppet Shout's already white. Just add a little bit of brown to it and maybe add a spot or two on there. Because he does have he does have spots. I, I, I'll tell you that right now. Uh, let's see if I can find another picture of him. Can't find, I can't find a good picture of his body. I know we, ha I know we have one of his body, like of him in coming in from outside or something out in the snow or whatever. Anyway, um, I had asked Dan if he could, like, customize a bop it shout to look like Alex's colors because the bop it shout really means a lot to me for because of Alex oh, excuse me because the bop it shout was 2008 and I got Alex in 2008 it was actually March 6th so that was over 15 years ago and yeah so um, I thought of that, but Dan hasn't gotten back to me, and I don't, I don't think he's gonna be able to do it. So I have another idea, and that is relating to the Boppet R2D2. So for some reason, the Boppet R2D2 reminds me of Alex in a way for some weird reason. I don't know what the reason is, but it's just. I don't know, it just, I think, the, I think it's the way my, my autism works, that certain, like, okay, certain characters and certain 
things remind me, or and then I take that back. People remind me of certain things. It's a classification. It's not as a rating or a judgment, uh, judgmental thing or anything. Um, it's just the way my autism works. So, for example, like I said, Alex is both of those boppets. Um, for some reason, I had a I had a a friend in middle school. His name was Casey. And for some reason, I related him to the letter J. I don't know why. Don't don't ask, cause I have no idea why. And hopefully, he doesn't watch this video. Um, I haven't talked to this kid in years, so I doubt he'll see it. But um yeah it it's weird how my autism works like i've even connected my okay you guys are gonna laugh at this i've connected my mom to squidward from spongebob before i it sounds harsh i know but my mom used to play clarinet in high school and a little bit in i think after high school and it just it just reminded me of Squidward. I don't know why. Ah, crap. My chicken patties are cold. But, um, I don't know. I don't know why that has a connection. But, anyway, um, going back to Alex and R2-D2. So, what my plan is is I'm going to find another Boppet R2-D2 on eBay that may be broken, maybe whatever. Because all I'm going to use it for is like the actions. Yeah. I just tapped it. I didn't actually bop it. This this thing works great. Um, but I'm going to I'm going to try and make the Boppet R2-D2 into a almost like a design that Alex would look like. I know it sounds weird, but think about it. I, a bop it, bop his head, twist his head, pull his legs. These The legs could be like his front legs. Um, I don't know how the back would work. If I would have like, almost like a little body or something to like, almost look like he's actually I don't know it would take a little bit of work and what I'd have to do is cover this whole thing with either paper or something to get rid of like all the detail on the R2-D2 itself and yeah it's just just a little idea for a project I had in mind um, like I said I'd I'd have to cover up the details somehow and then use paint or whatever. I mean, it's it's still in the brainstorming phase. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but we'll see. But anyway, I just wanted to share that idea with you guys. Um, I'm going to finish eating my supper here, and I'll leave it at that. So, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys, where are you, there you go, next time. Later.